Here's how I made this stylized item box for Mario Kart using Godot and Blender. The mesh is just a cube with a bevel modifier. I also use a data transfer modifier to project the normals from a sphere. This makes the highlights look better. I write all of my shaders myself in Godot. For the inside of the box, I sample this noise texture twice at different scales and speeds. I subtract the results, then smooth step and clamp to get this pattern. Finally, I multiply it by a scrolling rainbow texture. The material uses the normals as the UVs, which makes the textures warp along the cube. The outside of the box has highlights and a fresnel that are smooth stepped for a stylized, shiny look. Then we combine it all together. The inside, the outside, white and rainbow outlines using the inverted hull method, where we only render backsides of faces, and finally a billboarded question mark that always faces the camera. Oh, and I almost forgot, the screen tone glow. It's actually just an inverted sphere mesh. I calculate the Fresnel value, then use that as the UVs, so the rainbow scrolls outwards. I also use the Fresnel value as the alpha for a screen space, screen tone mask. Finally, I animate it rotating and floating, and it's done. Thanks for watching.